Google Earth can be quite the hassle to handle, and that's because it likes to give you some obstacles. And these obstacles can be anything from lagging to not understanding some of the tools. And I'm going to cover tools in a separate video, but for right now I want to give you some tips on how to prevent lagging when you're loading Google Earth or even using Google Earth. So one of the big things is right now on Google Earth there is a layer and it's this gaining a new perspective layer. And all you have to do to make this not be an issue anymore is hit the don't show again. And all that's going to do is make it run just a little bit faster. To make it run even faster you need to take out the startup tips. These startup tips are really short versions of something that is better shown in a video and is better shown actually on YouTube by Google or by someone who knows Google Earth very well. So all you have to do is make sure this little box right there is unchecked and then hit close. And then you don't have to deal with that. The next thing that you have to do is make sure that this button over here on the left side that says sightseeing tour is unclicked. And the reason behind that is this file is actually pretty big. It has a lot of information um, for each of these tours. It has the geographic coordinates of each spot. It has the photographs of each spot already pulled up. So it's best to actually already have it turned off. All it's going to cause is a lag on Google Earth when you try and move about the planet while doing your projects. The next thing you want to do is go down to primary database under layers. And the reason why you want to turn off all of these for right now is that you're not going to use most of them. The ones that you're probably going to use are borders and labels and maybe photos, but what's most likely going to be used is borders and labels. And you can keep that one on if you want, or you can just turn it on when you need it. But it's much easier if you don't have everything turned on at the same time. And that's basically what you need to turn off to be able to run the computer a little bit faster when trying to load something. Um, because if you're trying to load five different layers on top of one spot, the computer is going to be loading for quite a while. You'll see this little blue circle down here in the right corner loading for like a minute to two minutes. Um, and that's if you're on a fast computer. If you're on a slow computer it can be running for... I've sat there for five minutes sometimes. So it's best to turn these off because it will be faster for you. Um, and then if you want tips on what tools to use on Google Earth, please see the next video.